Um, Main New York City factory footage, uh, it's going to be a little different, uh, you know, this week and other weeks. Here are some of the face shields that uh, we just delivered the latest batch to New York City Gov. Um, here is a time lapse. We use a power stapler um, for the uh, high output ones that we need to do, you know, thousands of. These are the foam based ones with um, elastic and the PET G plastic. And those are the ones that uh, you, you can do the most. Uh, and also, from the feedback we got from doctors on the front lines, uh, they like these the most. And uh, we got some good feedback about ours. They um, last really long and they are fog free. So, this is um, some of the team. Um, you know, you have to make sure they're clean. You have to do, there's a lot of process that goes into it, it's a manual process. Um, you can automate some of it, but right now, um, this is uh, one of the ways that you can make this particular type. We have the 3D printed ones as well, um, and those are kind of uh, band-aid ones that we'll uh, give to various hospitals and doctors while we're making the larger batches. Um, another time lapse, uh, this is Vance, and uh, this is the uh, clear plastic ones getting wiped down with uh, alcohol on each one. Uh, we have a pretty sterile process that we have to stick to. And then um, on the uh, other side, you can see we have um, some tools that we use that helps people um, get these done really fast. So applying the foam, put it in there. Next, applying the foam. Next. And uh, here you can see the foam being sliced up. Now we're getting the foam pre-slice. So it wouldn't be a made in New York City factory footage without some footage on the outside. Of yeah. So that is uh, Empire State up there and you can see it pulsates at night. <laughs>